I love this city because it's chaotic. There's not only one center. It's a huge city. You can see anything you want. Istanbul is alive day and night. I mean, we have two continents, European and the Asian. But it really is the melting pot of food and culture and customs of traditions. The music back in the 70s was really made with spirit. They pressed maybe thousands and thousands of 45s in 70s in Turkey, a lot of singles. The record company's top pressing records early 80s in Turkey. So most of the records, they're all rare because no one liked it that time. Because it's good. It's not kitschy, it's not pop, it's strange and it's really good. We have so many different genres that we enjoy, from arabesque to Anatolian rock to psychedelic funk to disco, hop and, and jazz fusion and everything. It's a great combination of Turkish folk with uh, Western instruments. They, they were playing like African drummer and bass guitarist, but Melodies was uh, from East. Digging in Istanbul right now is really popular. So, uh, uh, record digging community, it's not local anymore, no? it's more like a global thing. With the help of internet, we became a, a community. And with the help of stores, people started to know each other and uh, they got connected. The collectors and the diggers, we are all friends. We are sharing stuff every day. We have this, do you know this one? You don't have in lots of other countries is somehow the survival of, uh, of all this heritage and that combined with a revival. DJs, radio shows have a huge, podcasts have a huge role making this rare records popular. We are building a genre, building a, a new way of look to Turkish stuff. Oh, it's like a do-it-yourself do culture. So we continue to present new music on vinyl. But I'm sure the community will grow. We are going to see more represses of you know, old music, but also local labels, also press from new artists. What I love about digging in Istanbul is you have very, very diverse record shops. You can dig in two different continents, Asia and Europe. You can check Bomonti uh, flea market on Sunday. You can check out stores in Kadıköy, like vintage records. In Europe side, you can check out Deform, Contra, Plug. Zigni Records, it's uh, been here since 92. Zoltan Records, they have a really nice Turkish selection. Here is Deep South. Deep South is one of my favorite shops. You can find uh, some really nice Turkish gems at Deep South. It's a must, I have to say. I have many favorites of Turkish records, but I can say one of them is Özdemir Erdoğan's uh, Aç Kapıyı Giriçeri. I discovered this track in 2008. I was playing it as a last track on my sets. And then I edited it and I played in, in any second of my set after the edit. And it was also playing uh, at my daughter's birth <laughs> at the hospital. And I, I picked it, uh, you know. Doctor said, you can pick one track. And I said, okay, I'm a DJ. <laughs> I, I want to pick a track. So yeah, there's a lot to dig in Turkey from 70s or new. Come and dig. <laughs>